Chapter 8, we are still in space. Uh, in this chapter, we have Kirby and Meta Knight about to take on Marx. So already we've been introduced to two bosses in the actual world of light. Uh, and we're also reintroduced to the Odyssey crew. Uh, turns out they were launched so hard that they wound up in deep space, which is wild, but something that Bayonetta would absolutely be able to do. But uh, here, they're all coming too, and they see the Wolfen zooming past them, which can only mean that Wolf is inside. And here he is, running from our wings containing both Fox and Falco. Wolf turns around, engages in a dogfight. Nearby, we continue the battle between Kirby, Meta Knight, and Marx. Behind Marx appears a crazy hand for some reason. And Marx causes this huge explosion, sends a shockwave, sending, you know, the spaces out of their fight, crashes straight into the Odyssey, and tears it apart, sends everyone inside into space, and canonically, I know Mario's fine. Everyone else, I'm just kind of, you know, it's Nintendo. They're not going to die. Um, but yeah, the spaces are sent hurtling. Wolf specifically is sent hurtling towards Earth. Um, here we're, we see Samus again riding in her ship. She feels the shockwave as well, uh, but she's further away, but is approaching. Uh, looks up and sees specifically... Dr. Mario and Mega Man floating through space. She says, like, hey, I know those guys. They should not be out here. Uh, brings them into her ship. But they are more or less okay. And she leaves, but manages to not notice the inklings. So they're still left out there, unfortunately. 